it, I guess. Uh huh. I'll miss you. Same. Do you think we'll be able to stay in contact? You bet. Well, what time are you leaving? You know, in like an hour or less. Oh, okay. <sighs> All packed? Mm -hmm. uh, let's go see what our parents are up to. Yeah. Day of school without Samantha. Let's see where this goes. Hmm, what to wear, what to wear. This could work. Cool. This is good. Hi mom. Hi dad. Hi sweetie, how'd you sleep? Pretty good, although I'm quite nervous with Samantha not being here for school. No worries honey, I'm sure you'll make some new friends. I agree with your father, honey. I'm sure you'll make some friends just today. You sure about that? Sure. Okay, if you say so. I better go get my bag ready. Okay, got my lunch, got my phone. Okay, all set. Bye, Mum. Bye, Dad. Uh, bye, sweetie. Um, excuse me. Oh, hi. Hey. Hi. Um, my best friend just left the school, so I was wondering if I could hang out with you guys today? Of course, no probs. We'd probably need to add some people to our friend group anyway. What have you got first? Science. Hey, I've got science first too. Which teacher? Um, uh, Mr. Eyre? Uh-huh, same. Looks like we're in the same class. Sorry, Julie. Nah, it's fine. I'll catch up with you guys at break. Cool, you know where your locker is? Yeah, as I said, my friend just left, but I just need some people to hang out with. Oh yes, of course. Um, which number is it? 309? <gasps> OMG girl! What? Your locker is next to Jack Walker's locker. He's like the hottest guy in the school. Really? Yes, really! Come on girl, you gotta go meet him! Are you sure about this? We are absolutely sure. <laughs> Come on! There he is! Come on, this is your only chance. Do I have to? Yes, you have to. If your locker's next to his, then you're gonna want to talk to him. So this is your chance to introduce yourself. But you know I've been at this school for literally since year seven, so I know who he is. Yes, I know, but you don't seem to know him too well. And if you've been at this school since year seven and haven't introduced yourself, then that's a problem, girl. This is the time to shine! Okay... Um, excuse me. Hi, my lock is next to yours, so I thought I might introduce myself. Oh, uh, sure. Hi, what's your name? Madeline. Mine's Jack. Uh, so... What have you got for? Science with Mr. Air. Oh, same. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I guess I'll see you then. Yeah, see ya. Bye. Girl, that was actually the best. Yeah, you killed it. I would have never been able to do that. <sighs> Thanks, guys. Well, uh... Uh, should we actually get to class now? Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Uh, see ya. Hello class, now today we will be looking at cells, can anybody tell me why they are called cells? <sighs> so we're late 
Mrs. Franklin. Oh, girls, you're in rubbish pickup duty now. Congratulations. <sighs> We're talking about cells. Go take a seat, please. Don't be late again. <sighs> now, as I was saying, class, who can tell me why cells are called cells? Sorry, Mads. Not super great on my first day of being your friend, getting you into rubbish pickup duty. Oh no, it's fine. Really, it is. No big deal. This assignment will be due on the 23rd of January, Miss Mia. Why are you talking? Uh, Not sure. Well, you know you're not meant to be doing it during class, so guess what? You've scored yourself another rubbish pickup duty, joining the other two girls. Congratulations. Now, when was the assignment due? Uh, 23rd of January? Hmm, very good. Now, class, as I was saying... <sighs> not my ideal way of spending break. Oh, Maz, I'm so sorry for getting you into this. Oh my gosh. Cleo, really, it doesn't matter to me. Like, really? <laughs> Plus, look on the bright side. We missed a couple minutes of boring science. And also, you're my best friend. I don't mind. Oh, thanks. And also, it wasn't just your fault. We were all talking, so, yeah. <laughs> Hey, uh, should we go say hi to that other girl over there? Sounds good to me. Let's go. Hey, um, excuse me? Let us introduce ourselves. My name's Madeline, and this is my friend Cleo. Hi! Um, so, by the way, if you're wondering, yes, I did change my outfit. I was wearing that silver thing on my ear, but it just got way too heavy, so I just changed. I have like a million outfits in my bag. Okay, that's cool. Yeah. So, what class do you have next? I have English. I have history. Oh, I have maths. Sorry, do you want to hang out at the cafeteria at lunch? Sure, sounds okay to me. Yeah, cool. Well, see you at lunch then. Bye. See ya. That lunch, I hung out with Mia. It was okay, I guess, although it was a little awkward. I'm not sure if I'll hang out with her again, but it was nice meeting someone new. Oh, oh, oh. oh I just love vines. I mean, writing reports. Um, excuse me, miss? Why, yes, Miss Madeline? May I go to the bathroom, please? Of course, dear, but don't be too long. Thank you. bubbly, irritating, and annoying personality really annoys me. And I actually had to sit with her at the cafeteria. It was awful. She wouldn't stop talking and I'm like, ah, oh, can you please shush for one second in my mind. What have I gotten myself into? I'm calling Cleo. Hi Cleo. too good. Huh? How come? Well, today I experienced something very terrible, let's just say. Wait, what? What happened? Well, so I was in English and I asked to be excused to go to the bathroom, right? Uh-huh. And when I went to the toilet, I was in the cubicle and I heard my name. It was Mia's voice and another friend. 
they started talking about how awful I was and that she hated my bubbly, annoying personality, that I wouldn't stop talking, and she told her friend to avoid me. And I'm like, who does that? And I can't believe we actually took the time to introduce ourselves to someone like that. Yeah, girl, what are you gonna do? Well, tomorrow I'm probably gonna speak to the wellbeing coordinator because, oh, I can't, I don't really wanna live with any of this in my mind. Me either. Want me to come over after school tomorrow and we can talk about it? Yeah, that would be great. Okay, cool. I'll ask my mum Okay, see ya. Bye. I can't believe she just betrayed us. <sighs> well, at least I know to avoid her now. <sighs> well, let's just say she's off our minds now. And I'm going to not speak to her again. <sighs> Hopefully I'll have fun with Cleo tomorrow. OMG! I can't believe he just did that! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Wait, so... If you don't mind me asking, what exactly happened yesterday? In a nutshell, Mia is a betrayer and I think we should just avoid her. Really? Yeah. We wasted our time introducing ourselves to her and she's just a waste of time herself. <sighs> okay. Well, let's just get off our minds right now. Yeah. Let's just enjoy this funny video. Yeah. <laughs>